So this was the night flight with the um, Femi Mini 3. I was really surprised to how clear the app view was, which I've already posted and you can see that. Um, but how clear it was on the app. Now, I've watched a couple of videos about this. Even Captain Drone says when you're actually moving with the um, drone, the footage gets a bit blurry and stuff. But when you're actually stable, and you set video in the cars go past and stuff like that, and the drone's not moving, it's really, really impressive. So maybe some EIS or something like that to help it would be an advantage. Unfortunately, you know, it's a very cheap drone, so you're not going to get that out of it. But on a whole, I was really happy with the footage I got. Um, I have done several ones with the Autel, the Mini 3 and um hubs and ones hubs and ones take some beating as well i think you know but again you're paying a lot more money for the drones this is a it's a budget price to be fair i mean i see drones coming out now for like three four hundred because they have a screen rc femi doesn't have that for the mini but um it has this new half inch sensor which they've done something with it well, Sony's obviously done something with it to make it look as good as it does. Um, and like I say, for the price, I think it's really, really good. Um, it's got lots of features on the drone. And, yeah, the night the night scenes I, I'm, I'm really happy with. I'll be using it again. I will be doing it um, as the year continues on and the, the nights draw in. I will get out there and do different ones, try and get the sun set a bit more um, and see see how good it is at Christmas time with them lights on and things like that so there's a lot to look forward to and comparisons with other drones as well but, um, I had to put my money where my mouth was because I was running the drone down saying this and that and you know, I have to eat my own words now and say it does actually look pretty good um, they've put an extra antenna in which is what me and several other people said it should have had in the Mini 1 anyway having one antenna was just not good enough you turn one way and you lost signal and it starts to return home that's always been a problem with the um, Femi Mini this seems to have corrected some of that I wouldn't say all the bugs have gone out of it um, now when I was flying on the, on on the other flight that I did earlier with this one, um, in sort of half daylight, half evening, because it was coming in into the sunset, I had a little bug where I couldn't get HDR on the video, but I could get it on the photos. Um, and now as well, I couldn't get HDR to compare HDR on the evening. N now. Um, HDR wasn't even available so there is a couple of little bugs still in the app let's hope they put them right I hope you enjoyed the video I think I've talked enough for it um, you can see for yourself this is unedited I've put a couple of pictures at the end but I haven't coloured it I haven't done anything with it I've downloaded it from the SD card and put it up so hope you like it thanks a lot for watching till the next one